What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my SpongeBob SquarePants Revenge of the Flying Dutchman Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing Downtown. Let's get right into it. So, we just loaded in here. Uh, the cutscene was last episode because I came in here a little bit early. But, uh, yeah. So, I think what we're going to do first is just kind of run around and collect everything. I need to find a area to change into my uh, jellyfish catching uh, suit. Which I probably should have done that before I came here. I might actually go do that real quick before I, uh... Do anything here. So, I'll be right back. Alright, back here. With my jellyfish, uh... Things. I need to figure out how to get up there. And then, I don't think I have to kill enemies here. Is this good? It is, let's go. Yeah, so, gotta run around, collect everything that I can before I talk to Mr. Krabs. And it'll give us kind of an idea of the layout of this uh, little city. Oh, I failed. No! Let me up! That's weird. Uh, wait, did I jump from here? No, I didn't. But, I probably can. There we go. Dude, I did- Did I really just do that? Dude, why is it not letting me up? Alright, there's our first one. Dang it. Okay, I need to wait for this thing to come around. <laughs> Just keep running around in circles and missing it. Okay, so there's an easier way to get up here, I guess. Oh, that thing came for me. All right. That was dumb of me. Get back here. Cool. Oh, there's little alleyways and stuff too. I gotta be careful. I'm not missing these little uh, drain things right here. No, I missed. All right. So far, so good. I still gotta pay attention. I'm looking up. Seems like there's one under every light, though. Most lights, at least. I missed! There we go. And I need to get on top of that door somehow. Ow! Okay, let's try to get up here real quick. Let's go! So far, so good. There's probably, like, a much better route than I'm taking to. There we go. Honestly, I thought those things were going to be more of a pain to get. Get that real quick. Alright. Am I back to the start? Yeah, I am. Okay. So, I'm going to head back down here. Um, do I go for the alleyway? I'll go for this alleyway, I guess. Get that bad boy. And all oh, the ones in the trash. Whoa, he almost bit me. Okay, that alleyway is over with. I'm actually just gonna cut back across here. Save a little bit of time. Ow. Okay, I need to find health. I'm taking way too much damage here. I'm just playing very, like, careless. <laughs> uh, I might just do this just to get the alleyway over with. And it looks like we got our first tile in here, too. Let's go. Alright, before... Oh, wait, there's a chain station right there I could have just, uh, used instead of going back. Okay. First tile, right there. I'm just going to continue down this way, though, just so I don't miss anything. We'll make our way back over there, though. Alright. Kind of curious how many coins are on this level, because I know there's like a few different areas. Alright. There's, uh, is there anything with this? No, there's not. Actually, that might just be so I can get these. 
Get that bad boy. Let's go. Oh, I already got that. Sweet. Nice and easy. Alright. There's a slide. Did I miss a light? Did I get this one? Yes, I did. Okay. Can't forget the dumpster. I'd be careful I'm not missing jellyfish either. I'm kind of just focusing on the coins right now. Oh, there's one. Alright. Oh, I missed. Get back here. Alright, cool. Oh, and I got the jellyfish already, too. Let's go. Do they just get, like, a PNG and put on there? <laughs> Alright. Let's get this door. Give me it. Okay, cool. There's health out there, too, which is pretty good. Kind of need it right now so I don't die. Whoa. That was a little close. Alright. And I think we should be almost done with the coins out here. Get out of here. Okay, that was a little bit close. I like how they have, like, evil Garys out here. I mean, I guess they're not really Gary. Uh, not gonna do that just yet. Did I? Okay, so let's just completely refill your health, it looks like. I haven't really been paying attention to that, because I haven't, like, lost enough health, I don't think. But that's good to know. Did I just see jellyfish on top of this building? How do I get up there? Oh, no, it's right here. Okay, it comes down. I think. There we go. And then... I think this is the last of the coins, unless I missed a alleyway or one of the drains. Wait, was there an alleyway over here? Now I'm concerned. Uh, no. How many do I have? 36%, 44%. Okay, I guess we can just uh, continue on. I don't know if that's what I should have at this point or not, but... We can always explore later. Because I believe this is the end. Yeah, okay. Let's talk to Mr. Krabs. Glad you finally made it, lad. Between you and me and this here cart, there's no stopping us now. It's just like you said, SpongeBob. If no one wants to leave home, then we bring the Krusty Krab to them. I'm talking about food delivery. I'll put out a bag filled with patties whenever enough orders come in. You need to grab the bag and get to all our customers before it's too late. There might even be some tip money in it for you. This sounds like fun, Mr. Krabs. Great! This delivery is to a single location, 17 Seashell Street. Go to Seashell Street, then look for the 17 on the building, then drop off the food at the door. Our food is very popular, so watch out for rough characters who might try to take it from you. Now go to it, lad! Alright. 17 Seashell Street. And I believe if you look at these street signs, it has pictures, so I'm guessing it's down here. Just gotta look for a 17. Without getting hit by any of these people, of course. The big boys. There's 15, 16. It should be next one, right? 17, let's go. There we go, tip. Alright, I just wanna look at that real quick. Alright, let's go for, uh, what's it called? Delivery number two. I know, um, when I was younger, you know, a child, not knowing what I was doing, uh, I used to have a problem finding out where these go, and I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure, I don't know if they're all timed, but I'm pretty sure there is one area where they are timed, and I would have such a problem with that. The next delivery, Mr. Krabs. This delivery is a little trickier. There's a building under construction nearby, and it's full of very hungry workers. Okay, I guess I was the only one for this area. For now, at least. I think we come back. So let's just head to the construction site.
All right. Before we talk to Mr. Krabs, go back to the whole coin collection. Oh, I did not make that. Okay, I kind of jumped too high for that, but it still worked out somehow. All right. Go look around this area. We got a little blue guy over here and a green one over there. Ow. That was 100% my fault. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, um, I'm pretty sure we get a new costume here, but first I kind of want to get these. Whoa, that went down faster than I thought. Oh, get back here. Um, are there any other jellyfish in this area that I need to worry about? I have no idea. Hot villain, don't try to get away. For I am Barnacle Boy, Super Sidekick. You really had me going there for a minute, Patrick. Where did you get that great costume? I mailed in 450 kelp bar wrappers and got both official costumes from the Mermaid Man show. Oh, you got both costumes? Oh, can I be Mermaid Man? Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please. Oh, gee, I'd really like to, but I've been so hungry since I ran out of kelp bars. If only I had something yummy to eat. All right, deliver food to Patrick. So I guess we do have to do this first. Get out of here. Whoa. He's only two hits. I 100% thought that was just going to be like a three or four hitter. Find the two workers who placed the order. Some of the other workers might try to take the food from you. Order up. Okay. Am I not supposed to do this? I don't know. I guess we'll try. Okay, that works. Cool. I'm saved! Now we can play Mermaid Man for as long as we want! I put your costume in that tent over there, SpongeBob! Watch out, evil! Here we come! Alright, I have the Mermaid Man costume. Let's put that on. I think it gives us, like, strength. And we can throw stuff. Throw a water ball. Throw water balls to damage distant targets. Uh, I want to see something. I'm at 58% for the uh, jellyfish. Okay, cool. Because I will have to switch back eventually. Now, all we got to do is pick up these rocks and toss them in here. And it'll start lifting up these little platforms. And I missed. You walk so slow. If you guys don't know, or if you're new to the channel, I hate things that are just annoyingly like long like that, like take forever to move. Oh, I just totally messed up. And glide. Whoa, it's like lagging a little bit in this area for me. Just grab this stuff real quick. Why am I lagging so much? Alright, might as well just get these while we're over here. Just so I don't have to climb up that wall again. Alright, what next? Oh, I missed! That sucks. Can I get this? No, I can't. I have to go all the way around. Which is unfortunate. I'm also kind of curious if I can get this jump. Okay, okay, cool. Which means I can hop on this thing again. I'd rather go up here and go to the other direction of the wall. Oh, I missed one. I have to be on the ball, too. Alright, I missed that coin. And then there's one that I need to grab. Right here. Oh, God. Okay, round number two on this thing. Hopefully we're almost out of this area. I'm not liking this little lag that's given me. I almost just missed that. Alright. Grab these bad boys and we should be able to go here. Get it. Cool. 
Alright, and I'll, I'll get the ones on the walls last. I'd rather not have to jump up here again. Well, I almost just fell. What's my health at for? Eh. I don't need that right now. I'm good. Alright, and I think that's all for this area. Except for the pants, but I don't really want to grab that right now. I wonder if it's these that are causing the lag. I don't know. But we'll play through it. It's all good. Alright. I will need to be... Can I aim with this? No, I can't. I will need to come back over here to get this guy, which is kind of unfortunate. Whoa! That is not what I expected to happen there. Um, is it just this? How do I get that? Um... Yeah, how on earth am I supposed to get that? Let me think. Maybe I have to deliver food to this guy first. And I'm- That was dumb. I'm also gonna switch to this real quick. So I can get that jellyfish. And I might as well deliver his food at the same time, if this is- if that's who it goes to at least. Hopefully it is. Because I'm pretty sure that's not a bad person, so... Alright. Go, 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 faster! There's also that guy to the right of the map, too, I believe. Alright. Do you want this? Go! Okay, I need to figure out how to get to that, but I also want to grab these. <gasps> no! That's unfortunate. Uh, I wonder if I lost those coins from dying there. I'm gonna finish collecting the jellyfish though, just so I don't have to change back again. Whoa. That felt bouncy. Okay, so there's a platform right there. Doesn't really do anything for us, though. Is there any, like, bad part about dying in this game? Because I don't think I lost anything. Oh god, that was fast. Okay, I believe that's the last person to deliver to, but before I do that, I do need to figure out how to get the, uh... The last coins over in that area. So, I need to switch back to Mermaid Man. Alright. And I don't think there's anything else in that area. I fell. Alright. Let's look at this again. Oh, I'm dumb. I, I just need to do a high jump. I think. Right? Yeah, okay. I'm just, I was just being stupid. Kind of forgot about that. Alright, and then I don't know what exactly this is gonna do. If I can hit it. There we go. What does that do for me? Just pants? Hmm, okay. Oh, this gives us a tile, too, so we had to do this. Okay. Those do a good amount of damage, it seems like. Alright. That's done. Let's go and, uh, get this last delivery done. It's kind of weird. Remembering these levels, and like most of the games I've played at least, um, remembering it from like my childhood, the levels seemed a lot longer, like this one specifically, and then also like 
the game seemed a lot harder, like Devil May Cry. But then again, that one did just scare me, so <laughs> I didn't, didn't get far no matter. Anyways, so. Alright, let's go talk to uh, Mr. Krabs. I'm pretty sure we complete everything in this area, though. Another bag of delicious Krabby Patties served up hot. Who wants a slice of this cakewalk now? This delivery won't be easy at all. Three different parties called from the high rise apartments. Three? All right, I might switch to fishing. Actually, there might be one over there. I would assume there is. I feel like there's one in, like every area that you load into. Because I think I'm going to need to uh, catch some more jellyfish. Yeah, definitely, because I'm at 65. I'm pretty sure I got everything so far, so let's head over. The first address is apartment nine. I wrote down the other two addresses for you. Make sure to visit both buildings. Good luck. All right. Is there a changing thing? Yeah, because there's jellyfish already. I might need to go back. I thought there was going to be one. Okay, I am going to go change real quick. I should probably look around. Uh, okay, never mind. I totally just missed that jump. I'm going to go up here real quick and then see if there's one up there. And then if it's not, then I will definitely... Go back and change. Probably off camera. Yeah, I'm gonna go change off camera. Oh, it's right there. I just jumped down too early. All right, let's go fishing gear. All right. There was a jellyfish here. Right? Yeah. And there was a green one, I thought. Did I not see a green one? Oh. And then I think there was ones here. And I think that's good for now. I'm going to try to collect everything here. On this side. Nice. And then, how do I go up? Is it the other side that I saw? Did I see something over here? I did, let's go. I think I just saw jellyfish. <gasps> oh, I got it, let's go. I probably could have stayed up there. I just freaked out. <laughs> All right, let's get back over here. Can I get on top of this? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, cool. So far, so good. What's my health at five? I do not need that. Ooh, I see a lot of coins to the right over there. All right, get this last coin. I really hope there's not a freaking delivery here, but there probably is. Oh, hey. I was like lagging a little bit. Nice. Okay. So grab all these things. I missed one, so I have to stay on here. All right. Where was the shellfish? Oh, it's right there. Get it. Oh. Tile up here. Let's go. Okay. And no, 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 no. That sucks, dude. I need to get on that hook. I think there's two hooks over here, if I remember correctly. Alright. Because this one's higher up, and I think there's one lower down there, too, like near the changing area. Okay. Oh, there's coins! Oh well. I'll probably head over there anyways. 
Okay, I'm just gonna jump down from here. I know I missed that jellyfish right there, but... I do remember there being... Whoa, that was faster than I thought. Okay. See, we're back anyways, I got it. Um, jump down again. Let me get on this buddy right here. Jump on giant jellyfish to ride it. I did just see a jellyfish fly down. Hopefully that's not required. Okay. There's an evil Gary right there. All right. What are we at? 91% and 85 or 89%. I wonder if there's exactly 300. Probably not, because I don't think it would move it that much, but... Yeah, no, definitely not. Oh! Okay, cool. So I got two more of those left. Okay. Whoa! That did not give me much time. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, another green guy right here. Cool. There has to be more, yeah. I see those, I just don't know how to get them. Oh, there's a freaking platform right there. How do I get there? How do I get to that platform? There has to be something I'm missing, right? Or just do that, okay. Okay, what's that? 97, 96. Almost there. Okay, I remember there was the, uh... The coins on those- on that thing? And I just died. Um, jellyfish though, I don't know where the last jellyfish is. If I'm gonna be completely honest. Whoa. I jumped off way too early, and I'm gonna fall for it. Dude, what am I doing? Okay. I wonder if it's the jellyfish I saw fly down, now that I think about it. Is that all? 99%. Okay, so I'm definitely missing one somewhere. Deliver to apartment 9. I honestly don't know where that is. I was not paying attention to the uh, signs at all. Okay, A, so 9 has to be up here then. Yeah, it's right there. Grab that. Where would 9 be? Did I take this one? I don't know if I took this one. But I also don't know if it actually takes me anywhere. Oh. This takes me over to 1. I wish there was a way to tell... Oh! Is this the last one? Okay, so jellyfish are done. <laughs> I don't know how I like miss that. Four. I'd assume that's over on this side. My brain is gonna hurt him to try to find this coin, though. So here's one, but I think this goes up more, yeah. Three, and then the four should be right up here. Oh, evil Gary. There it is. Once again, I think that the last coin would probably be in the first area. Because I think I've checked every place here. Might as well check up here, though. Unless well, there's something I need to break that I just don't know about. Okay. Got everything over here. Alright. Okay. 
I definitely think this place is cleared out. Um, where on earth could I have missed it? I need to be careful with that. I don't know if there's a game over or not. <laughs> Alright. Apartment number one. Isn't that just over here? Yeah, I think it's just that one. Come back, jellyfish, I need you! Thanks, buddy. Alright, probably what I'm gonna end up doing is... There we go. Um... Ow. I'm gonna go back to the main area. I just need a few more sand dollars, and then maybe I can get Sandy a gift! Well, this is your last delivery. Four orders have been called in from this neighborhood. Okay, I'm gonna go back to this main area and then I'm gonna look around before I do the Mr. Krabs thing. Cause I also think I missed money. Cause that that's not a hundred percent, is it? I kinda hope this doesn't just put me straight into that mission. Okay, cool, didn't it? Uh, yeah, I'm at 33. Alright. So, I'm probably gonna pause it and explore for a bit until I find this. Okay, so apparently I missed a corner right here at the start. Was that the last one? Yes, it was. Okay, I'm gonna go look for the, uh, sand dollars real quick. Alright, so I got all the coins and all that. There's no sand, uh dollars lying around that I could see because so I think they're all from just tips. Your first destination is 88 Albatross Avenue. I saw someone else who looked like a delivery boy, so be careful. Hurry up, lad. Time's running out. I don't even know what that is. Is that a bird? 88. Okay, so it kind of sound this way, so I'm guessing it is this way. Go, go, go. Is it right there? It is, let's go. So this is the timer one I was talking about, by the way. I think I always would get lost. I think I did beat it, like, overall, but, like, it took me multiple tries because I'd always, like, forget where to go. 24 Seashell Street. That would be down here. I really hate how slow I go. There might have been a faster way here. Because I feel like this is, like, at the end of the street. Yeah, it has to be. Almost there. There's 23, 24 right here. And I think it's faster just to go this way. This is the way I should have gone to begin with. I didn't realize it was at the end of that street. Go, go, go! Alright, where's my next one at? Stormy Way 10. Okay, so that's just down the street. I think I just passed it. Wait, is it right there? No, that's 13. 11, 12... 9... 10. Okay. Those were, like, weirdly numbered, I feel like. I'm gonna be one tile short though. I wonder what the last one is. 11 Seashell Street. Okay, that's just down here. Not too far. Kinda curious. What is that last one? Complete all food, help Sandy clean up the trash. I don't think I can do that yet, actually. So I guess we're not gonna be able to 100% this place yet. And look who's here. Trick, did you just deliver food to my customer? Hiya, SpongeBob. Are you delivering food for Mr. Krabs, too? Patrick, I am the only one delivering food for Mr. Krabs. Now tell me what you're doing here. You think you're the only one who can be a delivery boy? Well, I have a job now, too. And it's not my fault that you're slower than me. So if you'll excuse me, some of us have work to do. Mr. Krabs would have told me if he hired someone else. 
No, there's something definitely funny going on here, and I'm gonna find out who's behind it. All right. If something fishy's going on, I'm gonna go talk to Mr. Krabs. Figure out what's going on. How many tips do I have, actually? 70, that's not enough to buy anything. Nice work, SpongeBob! We've made enough money to call it a day! Uh, Mr. Krabs? Did you hire another delivery boy? Don't be crazy, lad! Why would I hire someone else when I can make you do all the work for nothing? <laughs> but I'll tell you, if someone was cutting into my business, I'd follow him until I found out what was really going on. Follow him, huh? That's not such a bad idea. Just make sure you don't get too close or they'll see that you're following them. Anyhow, I'm gonna pack up this stuff soon and head on home. Thanks for all your help, lad. All right, time for a stealth mission. Uh, where was the thing out of here? Is it just right here? Yeah, it was okay. There's no better feeling than having a full stomach and me pockets loaded with money. And now for a nice long nap in the office. If it's a long nap you desire, then I can accommodate you. A customer! Well, step right inside. Place your order. You got the wrong idea, crustacean. Just look upon this little treasure and let yourself rest. That's right. Sleep. Luke, there goes your delivery rival. Now is your chance to find out who is behind this. Don't let him get away this time. All right, so the Dutchman is taking people from us. We got to uh, kind of follow him right now, I guess. I'm going to switch to fishing real quick. No real reason, just so I have it. And I think I can kind of just hide somewhere until he gets to where he's going. He's kind of just wandering around right now. He looks so happy. And somehow we don't know where he works, which is a very weird. Do I have to like walk up to him? Oh, I have a lot of sand dollars now. Okay, so I think we go talk to him now. I'm sorry, Mr. Krabs, but all those people who ordered food told me they already got it. Full, worthless lackey! Uh, I mean, that's okay. Others will soon phone in their orders and will be ready and waiting to intercept their calls. Aha! I'm on to your little scheme now, Mr. Krabs. It's all too clear that you're the one who's been trying to put the Krusty Krab out of business. Uh, uh, hi, SpongeBob. Are you a worthless lackey, too? Now I'm really confused, Patrick. Why would Mr. Krabs try to put himself out of business? It's you ignorant buffoons! Plankton? Of course, you nattering nincompoops. Who else has the intellect to mastermind such a plan? I would have succeeded too if it weren't for your utter incompetence. Does this mean I don't get that raise? Let's face it, Plankton. Evil does not pay, or even get very good tips. Your days of impersonating Mr. Krabs are over! You may have won that round, SpongeBob, but I don't need a disguise to separate your crabby boss from his fortune. 
Behold! The greatest attraction to ever appear in Bikini Bottom! Chum World! Hey, everyone will spend so much money here, they won't have any left to buy your pathetic Krabby Patties. Now I'm off to Jellyfish Fields to watch the invertebrates get tangled in nets of torture. Ta-ta! I hate to admit it, but that Chum World looks kinda fun! Yeah, fun. Where did Plankton say he was going? Uh... Jellyfish Fields! Alright. Get Chum World Pass from whatever, whatever. Uh, okay, so downtown's 100% complete, apparently. Except for the B right there. And then this is pretty much done, right? Uh, Treehouse Dome, Jellyfish Fields. Uh, we could go buy that thing for Sandy now. And I think that should be a this episode thing. Just because it is kind of a side quest, and I think it does open up the Tree Dome. to save Gary. I just want to borrow it for a little while, but how will I ever get it away from Squidward? You must sneak up on him while he's napping so he doesn't wake up. How do I get him to nap? Oh. Dang it, dude. How far do I have to be? It's so slow, dude. Guess we'll deal with it. I'm just gonna try not to go forward any more than I already am. We're very, very quiet. Get it! Go, go, go! Okay, cool. How to defeat evil spirits. Chapter 8. The Flying Dutchman. Any poor soul who awakens the Dutchman must suffer his revenge for all eternity. The only defense against the Dutchman's magical powers are his most personal treasures. These are items which he carried close to him while he was alive. Find all seven of the lost treasures in order to face down the Dutchman once and for all. That's it! All I have to do is find the seven lost treasures of the Dutchman to end this once and for all. Barnacles, I thought this would be a challenge. All right, so we already got one of those, which was the sock. I'm ready to buy this acorn now, Squidward. Well, well, maybe I won't have to sit out here all week after all. The acorn is yours. I'm sure Sandy will love it. Now that's not very scary. How does Squidward expect to protect his garden with that? True. It is not scary when it sits still, but it's really something when it moves. Do you see that little fan nearby? You can blow on the fan with your reef blower to activate the mechanism. Okay, we don't have that unlocked yet, just just yet, unfortunately. I think Hiya, Sandy! Boy, am I glad to see you! You won't believe what happened to me and Gary this morning. Let me guess. Curiosity got the best of you again. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Well, don't you fret, little varmint. This squirrel knows just the thing to cheer you up. A good old-fashioned karate match. Just step into my arena when you're good and ready. All right, we're going to do this real quick. It's kind of just like a mini game. And I, I think we need to do this to unlock her in downtown to finish up that one task to... Now listen up, because I'm going to remind you how this all works. We've got a short amount of time to bust up all this junk in your yard. The person who breaks the most stuff when the time runs out is the winner. Just tell me which moves are legal, if you have the guts. I'll teach you a few moves. You can press the action button to karate chop, and press the action button a couple of times to chain attacks together, press the action button in the air to do a kick. Got all that? Ready, set, 
Go! Go, go, go. Hey, she hit me. Okay, that's not a one. I'm pretty sure I could break stuff like that, yeah. Ow. Dude. Get on. Ow. 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 Nice. Yeah, I'm doing good so far. I don't think she can really catch up at this point. Get it! Ow. Yeah, okay, cool. I gotta admit, SpongeBob, that was some tussle. You did okay for a sea critter. <sighs> that plum took all the fire out of me. I'm going home for a nap. Why don't you drop on by my tree dome and pay a visit, okay? That was sure swell of Sandy to cheer me up. I wish I could do something special for her. I know! I'll give her a present! But what would Sandy like? Mm -mm. All right, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe. It would really help me out, and I would really appreciate it. Anyways, thank you guys for watching.